And turn now to that big news from one of the biggest stars in sport. Miami Heat superstar LeBron James has become a free agent, wants to explore his options. But does King James really want to leave the Heat, or is this a power play to force changes in the team? ABC's Matt Gutman has the story. The king of the dunk, that no-look pass, and the clutch three may be on the market for a new empire to reign over. LeBron James, a.k.a. King James. <laughs> announcing free agency Tuesday, just weeks after his team, Miami Heat, melted in the NBA Finals against the San Antonio Spurs, Spurs in the, the team's fourth straight champions. finals. They were the better team, you know, and that's why they're the champions. While he's arguably the league's best player, he's not its best paid player, ranking ninth just under $20 million a year. Not bad. But he took a pay cut in 2010, breaking Cleveland's heart and heading to Miami in a much mocked media stunt called The Decision. And this far, I'm going to take my talents to South Beach. Where might he be taking his talents next? By opting out of his contract Tuesday, the 29 year old superstar now has plenty of options and could even re sign for more money. Miami, still a top choice because it can offer LeBron the longest and most lucrative contract. And prodigal son could even return home to Cleveland. If they get LeBron James, you could argue very strongly that they'd have more talent around him now than they had before when he was there. And they won 66 games one year, 61 another. His wife's Instagram picture fueling speculation he might be doing just that. The Chicago Bulls and the Houston Rockets are contenders, and both the L.A. Clippers and L.A. Lakers are reportedly in the hunt. Wherever he goes next season is definitely going to be a contending team. But, of course, the most intriguing question is, will LeBron dump Miami and return to his first love, Cleveland? Odds are that's not going to happen. But here's why snagging him could be so important. A study showed that since LeBron came to the Heat, the team helped bring in $1.4 billion and 21,000 jobs a year to the Miami economy. George. Yeah, not chicken chickens, no. Okay. Didn't, need, didn't need a study for that. <laughs> no. <laughs> you kind of figure that one out. Hey, Matt, thanks very much.